welcome to the Jamaica Young Police Channel. So you know, we continue the journey of the, yeah man, of the political assassination of Comrade Willie by official of the PMP LGBTQ plus party. Yes, and when we say that, we say that with no apologies because they knew they knew about the death threat against this man's life. And we are, we're going to go into an intimate way so that you people can understand the dynamics of how these people operate. Because they have no loyalty to no one, you know. It doesn't matter what, how many sweat, blood and tears you put in and put your work. They still will find some reasons because you have eaters, some reason just to kill you. And then they conjure up all kind of stuff, you understand? And tell lies to justify their illegal acts of killing others, other comrades. You understand? Oh, this man, this man, all and all of these people who's behind this killing. This man has been around for nearly eight decades. And you couldn't make this man make old age kill him. You have to send gunman, you have to send some coward to shoot him. Not even shoot him, make him see how I kill him. Make them hide and pretend like they want something to buy. Even the woman that, that called um, Comrade Willie, I saw you heartless, man. You know, no, you, well, you know, have no love inside of you. And look how, look how Comrade Willie is good to you. And you turn on the man, and you turn on the man, this man now no this man now no, no criminal in him family. This is one of my best comrade in the party. And you join with them and make them kill the man. I hope you can't sleep good at night, you know. Cause you know that you are the last person that call that called um Comrade Willie. You understand? I want the Jamaican people, you know. If you are not comfortable with these kind of killings and these kind of lifestyle, well, you know, you're setting up people, people who are close to you, people who even feed you and you're pitting them. Yeah, man, you, 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 you all want to go pitting them. And because of little lickings, you can call a man, a old a man who almost 80 and set up him life. Why? Why? Because you feel, say, boy, is that you behind the trigger, you're not responsible. You're fully responsible for the killing of this man. Because you are the one that call him and, and give them the green light. Say, yes. You must come down here. Yeah. Oh, you know, so I want you to listen, you know, and we'll continue the journey, you know. Because we are going to name names, you know. But we don't, we don't, we're going to name names. So you watch, you uh, listen, and you decide. He, he, he go by the name Jer, um, Jer America, uh, something like that. Uh, you, know, you know, I don't remember. But he had suggested, you know, it seems like, and somebody is saying that he um, he's re, um, he's racist. He don't like black people and all kind of stuff. And it's not that you know because what he's saying that you know that these black people have been failing us from independence because all they have been doing is corrupting the system. And we want some white people in you know, all of the government agency them and bring it back just like how before the British them leave. Then um, someone I'm um, going to attack him. Um, yeah, so young one, brown people in the bank and stuff like that. And the man said, no, that's not it. You know, what we want, we want back honesty, decency, ethics in the, in the country and them thing there. Because the black people, them are all uh, criminals. You understand? And criminal minded. And I tend to agree with him, you know. Because, you know, you've just reading, reading this thing here, um, this, um, Report from the court, and you know, the court award these men money because they were arrested. And you understand, so you know, it, it is it just mind boggling. If it was in America, they could not, they, they could not get a dollar from, from both um, TV stations. So that's why I love America, you know, because you see that Jamaica a criminals paradise, you know. You understand, I just pray that I just hope the prime minister get the FBI. The FBI, the Royal Canadian Mountain Troop Police and Scotland Yard to help them so they can bug some of them judge a phone and all them things 
and we, we, some of them can go to prison in America because you know the whole of them not the corrupt, you know. You understand the system is corrupt. It's tinged with corruption. You understand? Mr. Allen believed the law underpinning defamation gives the broadcaster defense grounds in journalistic principles. Calls to the office of the CEO of CVM TV, Shamina Khan, went to voicemail. So, you know, and, and here's another thing now, you know, Sylvan, Sylvan Reed, the PMP LGBTQ plus counselor charged with illegal possession of property was granted 250000 bail when he appeared in Montego Bay Registered Magistrate Court. The counselor was granted bail to surrender his travel documents and to report to the Mount Salem Police Station every Monday and Friday between 7 a.m. and 6 p.m. A stop order is also placed at all ports of entry. Reed was taken into custody by the Lottery Scam Task Force members last week. You know, that's from 2012. The police say that during the search of his carnal courts, Montego Bay home, a black 50-inch television was observed by the police. When questioned by the police, it is alleged that Reed told the police that he had purchased the item in the United States. However, he needed help to produce the custom documentation requested by the police. So, you know, that's that that's some context, you know, about um two other councillors in Ma in Montego in St. James. So last week Thursday now, afternoon uh, you know the um, as the cleaner said an eighty year old man was shot dead at a cook shop he operated it inside St. Clavers Transport Centre in Montego Bay, St. James. He has been identified as Les Moore Williams of Perry Street, address in Montego Bay. Reports from, Bar from the Barnet Street Police are that at, at about 2.30 p.m., Mr. Williams, Comrade Willie, who also managed, managed the St. Clavers Avenue-based transportation hub, was sitting inside his business place when two men approached him Posing as customers. Remember, it's a telephone call. Um, Comrade Willie got in. You know, that's why he went there. You know, he should not be there um, when they killed him. You know, it's a call he got from a woman. You know, yeah, he was set up. It is also report that one of the men placed an order, but before he could be served, he brandished a handgun, opening fire, hitting Comrade Williams multiple times. The men fled the area and foot. Williams was taken to the Carnal Regional Hospital where he died. The death of the elderly businessman came hours after gunmen attacked customers at a supermarket in Moy Hall, St. James, injuring two men. Report are at about 9 a.m. A motor vehicle drove to the community and its occupants opened fire in the vicinity of the supermarket hitting the two men. The injured men were taken to hospital. At least 182 people have been murdered across the parish of St. James. That was last year. So we don't even keep the tally of, you know, how the year end. You understand? So, you know, who, you know, Comrade Willie did a lot for the community, especially the youths. Many children will need lunch money and resources and support he provided. Some of Mr. William Jab is chairman of the railway garden basic school, which he uses his money to run. Comrade Williams provides food, clothing, and shelter for many struggling families or anyone who needs help. Also, countless children, including his relatives, whereas some are fatherless or motherless. Comrade Williams caused roads to be um, built, to be made in Birchill, provide running water, etc. So this man is very active in their community and know what the people them want and, and make sure that they get it. He uses influence and money to get people into work programs overseas. He helped others to own homes, establish businesses, and to own vehicles, sometimes using his own money to do it all. He gave them the know-how. 
he truly thought some out of fish and not just under the fish. He sent drug addicts to rehab, provide medical and dental assistance, and help with funeral expenses. He gives assistance for anything you need. Does it or know someone who can? He is never feel to assist and show love. Everyone say he's miserable. Yeah, and my man, Willie is an old man, and I say you must expect to come with Willie and I be miserable, you know. But guess what? He's the kindest and sweetest person you will ever meet. And you can ever find. He has given jobs and hopes to a lot of people. He has also helped a lot of people to keep their jobs. He knows that people have to hustle. So even though he sees and knows that those around him are stealing, he has never tried to stop their bread. Why, I mean, I like the part they still bread away, really, but I just saw it go. You know, you're a thing that people trust him to manage their business because they know he only take a dime if it is to give to him. They also know that he gets the job done. He's always on the go, go doing good and helping others. He is provided a lot of monetary and other otherwise support to the church, churches, and many small businesses that stay in operation. Yeah, man, Comrade Willie loved farming, which he also used to help others. But he had stopped because thieves would thief everything from the man. So, because a thief, brother, uh, Comrade Willie, just say, you know, I'm going to leave the farming alone. He knew and helped many people. He was a father and a father figure to a host of children that were not biological is. And he was also a relative and family member to others that were not in his bloodline. Lesmo William wasn't selfish. He even gave his sister a day out of the week to run the park and keep the monies. He was old school, fearless and respectful, set in his ways but still open to changes. He loved God and enjoyed the fellowship. He dedicated Saturdays to bonding with his eldest daughter via WhatsApp call, while he dedicated Sundays to his other children because some of his children live overseas. Yes, and he have, you know, family, he have son to wear a big, big detective in Jamaica. He was a dedicated family man and treasured every moment. He would share or give away his last to stop a gap or supply a need. People come forth out of the woodwork in disbelief saying he was a good and decent man. Why, my deepest condolences to the Williams family at this time. We know that it is very painful losing this man at such a age and you know we would expect that Lesmore Williams would live until old age take him we would expect that a, a, a man who is almost 80 this man have no children no involved in any criminal activity this man no involved in any crime all this man have been doing throughout his life is dedicate his life to the PMP LGBTQ plus party. And this is what, from inside of the party, what they have done to this old man, kill him. Because a man claimed that this man had wrecked his life because make him lose his seed. Now that's got what the, you know, that kind of madness. If the people them vote for somebody else, or if you believe me, that's, um, um, Comrade Williams... And said the man, mash up your life. And mash up the party. When this man have done, the man, the, uh, Mr. Williams, Comrade Williams have been working for the party before he even, for before all of these guys were born. All of these people who are in representation politics in St. James. This man has been active for the PMP, PMP LGBTQ plus party. And the man him killed the man. And I pretend like a robbery. And the same boy, them up at Salt Spring, um, chat. So what, them are kill them now too. 
because they know the secret, you know, because that's how it is, you know. They have to kill them because the boy, them, the, 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 you know, the boy, them know. But they have to throw the burner for now. Yeah, man. So, you know, you know, we, we keep Brother Will, um, Comrade Williams' legacy alive. And every time when you see him, see him in picture, you know. You know, it's an uh, aunt, you know. But remember, you know. You want to take Brother Williams' life, but you don't never take him soul. Because the soul belongs to God. I remember, you know. It doesn't matter how a guy think, you know, that he's invincible. Remember, your day I come to, you know, and you got dead like dog. You understand? And also, my pitney and all your wife and all them things. You, know. you go and wonder if I, if I, if I hope your people will be here, but I just judgment because you're wicked. You understand? What this man could say to you that you get man to kill him. The man reported to the police, the man reported to the EOJ, the man reported to the party. I want to still make them kill the man. Well, I know, that's why I'm, I'm, I could never be in a part of a political party. This is a peaceful man. The man don't have one criminal in his family. All of the man kids them. Who are a police, an educator. This is a, a comrade, you know. You understand? This man in the political party, in the party before most of, most of these people born. Even the boy will kill him. But when I call him, you know. You understand? Because you think that nobody never did see you and know you. You understand? But we are come with it, you know. Because you know, 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 you I want to kill the wrong man. Yeah, man, I want to kill the wrong man. I want to forgive you, you know. Yeah, man. We're not for forgiving none of you. The person who's responsible who send, send you guys, yes, him know himself. So nobody come round, you know. Nobody come round with a sham, you know. We know. We know, say, you are the man behind it. You are the only person who threaten him. Even the guy that punched him down and all them things there. We don't all of them things there. And we vex. You can't do that man, a old, old man man. The man not involved in a criminal activity. The man not stop nobody food. The man not interfere with nobody. The man a old man. Make him stay until him old age take him here send man go kill him. I saw your ego big. I oh, wow, you are some big sissy. Wow, what kind of panty you wear? Bingo, bingo panty, you, bingo bag panty you wear. Because most of them men be a you know. Come go coward do them thing there, you know. Intelligent people don't kill people because they have disagreement. Or because the person say or do something they don't like. You move on. You disagree to agree. Life is precious. But open your time coming, you, know, you take it with a smile, you know. And close your eye, don't fight it. And look up to the sky. And dead with your eye open. When you feel it, you just close your eye and go on. Because all away are dead. Every one away. So you are boss, yeah, when time you, you, you hear them, um, they kill him, yeah man, you feel good. Yeah man, but for how long? Why you think so? You're not going to do Yeah, that's another guess coming, man. We're vexed, man, because, and the reason why we're vexed, because we work with Brother William's son, one of them son. You understand we are police. Yeah, good, good, good detective. You understand? So, I just one of them to, you know, it's sad. All the best to the Williams family. And we know that justice will be served. If it's not served by man, we know God will deliver. And we know the two killers that they you know that they, they, you know the one that um, told his girlfriend and she tell her friend, and you know so that's how we know the names of the killers. Yes, man. But the next time we're coming out, yeah, man, we we'll call them names, you know. I just hope them don't kill them because you know them like to them send them and it's and then them kill them for keep them silent so them dead with the truth. But we are, you know, we are going to reveal it. Thanks for watching the Jamaica Young Police channel. So, you know, as we remind you guys, 
that brother, um, Comrade Willie, was killed by a random person. He was called. He was called by a female, and he went there, and they killed him. Thanks for tuning into the Jamaica Young Police Channel. Jamaica Young Police Channel, out. One love.